Um, okay, let's see what else did we have. Uh, wimpy men always get dumped. Uh oh. Uh, oh yeah, this is this now, guys. This is a fucking horrendous scenario. This is Jesus Christ. So if this story is true, this girl emails in and she says that uh, she was out with her boyfriend one night and a group of guys were actually taking the piss out of this girl. Now, total scumbags for doing this in the first place. Who the hell do these guys think they are? There's a couple and there's a group of group of dickheads like making fun of a girl. Are you kidding me? What the fuck? Now, maybe something else happened. I don't know, but there's no there's no excuse for that. You don't just start ganging up as a bunch of guys like making fun of a girl in front of her boyfriend. What the hell? Where, where are we getting with this? Where are we going where it's cool and tough to start mocking a couple when they're out, out in public? And here's the problem. The guy didn't stand up or he didn't jump in. And you know what? I'm always going to say it. I don't give a fuck. Maybe this is... No, this isn't old school. This is fucking... This is what men should morally do. You jump in for your girl. I would have thrown fucking punches at these guys. I don't give a fuck. Now, maybe not throw punches instantly. I certainly would have confronted them. Hey, what the fuck, assholes? What, is everything okay? Go fuck yourself. If it got really bad, I would have swung punches for my girl. Because you know what happens in these scenarios? And I think it's an, it's an, it's an important one to address because... It's a really tough scenario for a guy. Like, I'm a type of guy now. I go out at nighttime. There is... 0% that I want to get into a fight, a physical fight with anybody. I have absolutely 0% interest in picking a fight, getting into a fight with anybody, taking out my anger on anybody. You know, I don't want to be doing this. But I tell you, if I'm out with my girl and this scenario happens, like this is just going to lead to resentment. If, like, if Peter doesn't jump in, because he just wants to, you know, well, let's just ignore them, this and that. She's going to go home. She's going to think about this. And it's going to fuck with her head. And quite honestly, I don't blame her. It would fuck with my head if I was a girl. Or if there was a guy, you know, if there was someone that could stand up. No, I wouldn't be. Sorry. I'm talking shit. I wouldn't be looking for anybody to stand up for me. I can choose my own fights and battle my own fights. What am I trying to say? I'm trying to put myself in this scenario, guys. My apologies. If there was a scenario where somebody could have jumped in for me, in any kind of scenario, whether it's physical or just a verbal fight, well, I'd be like, oh, well, thanks for having my back, dickhead. Like, I'm not thinking very highly of that person. And I tell you, especially, and it's more intense, I think, anyway, when it comes to a relationship, if a guy doesn't jump in and stand up for his girl... Like, I even think, well, even if the girl says, oh, no, look, honey, forget about it, forget about it. Even if he doesn't and he goes, okay, honey, I won't. That girl's going to go home and go, oh, well, he backed off easy enough there, didn't he? Or what if he doesn't jump in in the first place? Is, is the girl going to really have respect for you? What happens if it happens the next time? Is he going to have my back? I mean, let's go back to our DNA here, guys. You know, we're meant to be the cavemen and and protect, take care of, provide for the woman where the woman takes care of the, the family in the background. Like, this is in our fucking DNA. We can't ignore it. It is in our DNA embedded into us for, what, millions and billions of, or whatever we've, however we've been along, millions of years. So, guys, you know... It's a tough situation to go into because maybe you're not the type of guy who wants to get into a fight. Or, look, you gotta jump in. You gotta stand up for her. You'll be the fucking... Even if she's like, no, Peter, no, don't don't go. You fucking go anyway, man. Because that's fucking taking... That's taking a stand. That's fucking being a man. That's balls. Even if you get your ass whooped. Fuck it. Fuck it. Now, I'll give you a scenario here. Funny story. I had a girlfriend, what, five five six years ago and we were outside this pizza uh pizza restaurant uh, fast, uh, fast food pizza and i was waiting outside she's getting a few slices of pizza so I, I see this guy inside and he calls my girl a fucking bitch and i actually catch it at the perfect time i went whoa 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 i i ran straight the fuck in and she's trying to tell me oh no no okay easy easy i'm like no fuck and I asked your man to step outside. Here, come on out here, asshole. 
Now, I was really drunk, and he comes out, and I was like, okay, so what's, what the fuck's going on here, buddy? And, I, and I'm ready to fight, guys. Of course, problem is, I got punched in the face, dropped like a fucking, <laughs> dropped like a, I don't know, a sponge right to the ground. But the point is this. Now look, number one, I was locked drunk. Couldn't, I couldn't open a door for you. But still, the point is this. Whether I won or lost, or not, it's not about winning or losing, but you know, whether I put him on the ground or he put me on the ground and he put me on the ground, the point is this. You go down swinging, guys. Go down fucking swinging. And I was, there was no regret in the back of my head the next day. There was no, oh, fuck, I lost. No, nope, because I stood up to him. Doesn't matter. Doesn't matter if you get pummeled, or you pummel the other guy, or you get hit, or you get he gets hit, whatever. Go down fucking swinging, boys. Because I tell you now, you feel like a fucking hero. And everybody was all over me after that happened. And I'm not joking you. She thought I was a goddamn hero. Didn't matter. She literally thought I was a goddamn hero afterwards. She was all over me. Because the fact that I jumped in and I was there to protect, try and protect her anyway in this scenario. Couldn't with too much drink in me, but I was there to try and do it anyway. Always go down swinging, guys.